morning, Spartans. Today is Friday, March 19th, and here are your Spartan news. Drama now presents Lockdown Travelogue. Hi there, or should I say bonjour? Since the lockdown has been lifted, lots of people are deciding where to go on vacation. Well, I know the place just for you. Paris! Most people come to Paris for the love, romance, all that sappy stuff, but that's overrated anyways. The reason you should come to beautiful Paris is for the art, the fashion, the landscape, and most importantly, the food. If you're looking for an exquisite view, going to the Eiffel Tower is just for you. Tummy is rumbling and you need some food soon? Come to a local bakery where you can get baguettes, croissants, and even macaroons. Getting a little full from eating too many tarts? Head over to the Louvre where you can see such divine art. There is so much more you could do in Paris. You just have to come out here and see for yourself. Au revoir! Congratulations to Kayla Farmer. She entered into the California Education Theater Association speech competition this last month. Her speech on what does theater mean to you made her one of the top finalists in the state. Congratulations again, Kayla. You have earned it. The word of the week is hero. Hero, a person who is admired or idealized for courage, outstanding achievements, or noble qualities. Young man, you too can become a hero. <laughs> Dreams can become reality. Congratulations to Giselle Gutierrez for her You Are Not Alone film in the Student Voices campaign. She is one of 15 top finalists for the state of California. Congratulations again. You've earned it, Giselle. Today, after school at 1230, we are kicking off spring break with a awesome game of Among Us. You're not going to want to miss out, so join us in the Zoom link on Spartan Splash. Hi there, Spartans. This is Mrs. G from your Brookhurst Library, here to remind you that today is First Chapter Friday. First Chapter Friday is a podcast where you can listen to the first chapter of what could be your new favorite book. Today's book is Baseball's Leading Lady, Effa Manley and the Rise and Fall of the Negro Leagues by Andrea Williams. Before Jackie Robinson broke Major League Baseball's color barrier in 1947, Black athletes played in the Negro Leagues on teams coached by Black managers, cheered on by Black fans, and often run by Black owners. Here is the riveting true story of the woman at the center of the Black baseball world, Effa Manley, co-owner and business manager of the Newark Eagles. Elegant and gutsy, she cultivated a powerhouse team. Yet, just as her Eagles reached their pinnacle, so did calls to integrate baseball, a move that would ultimately extinguish the Negro Leagues. On and off the field, Effa hated to lose. She had devoted her life to Black empowerment, organizing civil rights protests, investing in community programs, and, of course, fighting for her team's place on an unequal field. But in the battle for Black baseball, was the game rigged against her? Activist, competitor, trailblazer, and the only woman inducted into the National Baseball Hall of Fame. Next week is spring break, and although we will be taking a break from our coursework, the First Chapter Friday podcast will not be taking a break. We will finish out our Women's History Month highlights with one more book. Next week's book is Wolfpack, How Young People Will Find Their Voice, Unite Their Pack, and Change the World by Abby Wambach. From rising young star to co-captain of the 2015 Women's World Cup Championship team, Abby Wambach discovered what it truly means to be a champion through her extraordinary soccer career. Whether you're leading from the bench or demanding the ball on the field, real success comes from when you harness your inner strength, 
forge your own path and band together with your pack. In this edition of Abby's Instant Bet Seller, Wolf Pack, she traces her journey from youth soccer to the Hall of Fame, inspiring kids everywhere to unite as a pack and unleash their power. Both of these books are available for checkout now from your Brookhurst Library, and you can listen to these episodes and all of the other First Chapter Friday episodes in the Brookhurst Library Schoology course. Have a safe and relaxing spring break, Spartans. And here is our motivational quote of the week. You will face many defeats in life, but never let yourself be defeated. By Maya Angelou. And that's all for today, Spartans. Remember that without you, Brookhurst is incomplete. We care, we thrive, and we belong. We do our part because that is the Spartan way. We got this.